ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಹಿ ಓಂ ಜೈ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಅವರ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ಇನ್ ಅವರ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ ವಾಲ್ಮೀಕಿ ರಾಮಾಯಣ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಸೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಹೌ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ವುಡ್ ಇಂಟರಾಕ್ಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಅಗಸ್ತ್ಯ ಮಹಾಮುನಿ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಹೌ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ಸೀತಾಮ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಫೈನಲಿ ಎರೈವ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಗಸ್ತ್ಯ ಮಹಾಮುನೀಸ್ ಆಶ್ರಮ ವಿ ಹರ್ಡ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದಿ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ನೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಗಸ್ತ್ಯ ಮಹಾಮುನಿ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ನೌ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ಅಲಾಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಣ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸೀತಾಮ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಕಮ್ ಟು the at uh, the gate of the ashram and here he says to lakshmana oh lakshmana i wish to stay in this ashrama for the rest of the vanavasa agasthi mahamuni is so great and any person who has any bad thought in his mind can't even stay in this ashrama this ashrama is such a powerful ashrama a thief a person who uses his intelligence to rob others who uses his intelligence to trick others he too cannot stay in this place any person with a bad thought in his mind cannot stay in this place hence oh lakshmana this is such a great ashrama i want to stay here please go inside the ashrama and let the mahamuni know that sri ramachandra along with sita has come here and he is requesting the darshana of that mahamuni so lakshmana goes inside there he meets a muni and now this muni asks lakshmana as to why he is there and lakshmana then informs the muni that he is the son of dasharatha the younger brother of sri ramachandra and they are there on vanavasa hence they request the darshana of agastya mahamuni the muni then makes lakshmana sit there goes inside and meets agastya mahamuni and informs him that sri ramachandra and sita ma are awaiting his darshan Agastya Mahamuni becomes extremely happy and he says oh finally Sri Ramachandra has come here i have been waiting for him to come here finally uh, he has come so go and bring him with all respect inside the muni comes out and meets lakshmana and says where are sri ramachandra and sita ma lakshmana then leads the muni to the outer gate of the ashrama there the muni sees sita ma and sri ramachandra gives them ardhya and padya and with full respect he takes them inside as sri ramachandra is moving inside he sees the various places where devatas used to come and sit and pray agasthi mahamuni so the places for devendra the place of gandharvas the place of agni the place of kubera the place of yama all those places are seen by sri ramachandra again uh, it's worth noting here that this part this four shlokas which describe these places as seen by sri ramachandra are not a part of the pratchya patha the pratchya patha is another version of sri ramachandra ramayana where we see minor differences in terms of shlokas from the valmiki ramayana that we read from geeta press gorakhpur and all these days the pratchya patha has some minor differences but these four shlokas are not there in the pratchya patha to be very clear i just wanted to bring you that this fact also exists Now Sri Ramachandra walks in, he meets Agasthi Mahamuni, he prostrates, he does a Dandavat Pranama or a Sastanga Pranama to the Trishi, Sita Ma also does the Pranama to the Trishi, Lakshmana also does the same. Now Agasthi Mahamuni uh, asks how they are, how they have come, he lauds Sri Ramachandra for his good qualities, he says the way Yeyati's sons gave him glory, similarly you are giving glory to your father uh, Dasharada Maharaja. is what agasthi mahamuni says and now it's time for sandhya vandana and also agasthi mahamuni gets up sri ramachandra as we have been seeing he never misses his trikala sandhya vandana he never misses the nitya karmas that he need to do so sri ramachandra also goes and does that and comes back when they are back agasthi mahamuni talks about the importance of agni karya vaishya deva and he also says as to how a person who is cheating any other person in this world will not just be arrested and put in prisons in the in the naraka but he will also be made to eat his own flesh so this is something that agasthi mahamuni is now telling sri ramachandra so once the the importance of vaishnava deva and all are told agasthi mahamuni now does another thing he gives atidhya to sri ramachandra he feeds sri ramachandra he feeds sita mata uh, with uh, and he feeds lakshmana he gives them very nice fruits very nice honey he gives them kandamulas and all and they eat uh, very happily they feel very contented 
then agastya mahamuni goes and brings out a vishnu chapa akshay bana to niras and he give and, and a few swords and he says oh sri rama this vishnu chapa was used by sri mahavishnu in devadanava battles and he used this bow to save the devatas to save the dharma i am giving this to you now you take this and this will help you win your battles for dharma and then he also gives the akshay varna to uniras that devendra gifted to agastya maharshi those quivers of arrows will never run out of arrows so such quivers are given to sri ramachandra and uh, sri ramachandra uh, is also presented with swords lakshmana is also presented with swords so they take all those arms and they are happy at that point of time agastya mahamuni looks at sita mata and says i am so happy that sita ma has come here because there is a thing that's prevalent in this world where women leave their husbands when the husbands are in trouble but sita you have really shown exemplary values by following your husband even when he has come to the aranyas and then he lords sita ma for all her good qualities and he says wherever you stay you you guys are going to live very very happily again as ever agastya mahamuni also offers sri ramachandra to stay in his ashrama but sri ramachandra very politely asks um, uh, agastya mahamuni oh mahamuni is there a place where i along with these two people can go and stay yeah sri ramachandra also had the intention before to stay in agastya mahamuni's ashrama forever till the varanavasa completes but then out of respect he is asking now because you know he should never become a a, a burden on somebody else right so that might be the intention of sri ramachandra he is asking oh maharshi where can i go and stay then agastya mahamuni is saying if you go for for four yojanas from here there you would see a place called panchavati and you can go to panchavati you can stay there you can make a you make a parnashala over there and you stay there there you have got very nice river there you have got very nice waters you have got wonderful trees you have got a beautiful place so that's the place where you need to go and stay oh sri ramachandra i i also wanted you to stay here but from what i understand it's better that you go and stay in that ashrama now sri ramachandra sita ma and lakshmana they take leave of agastya mahamuni and from there they start their journey towards panchavati now how do they reach panchavati what do they do there that's for us to see in next episode sarve bhavantu sukhinah sarve santu niramaya sarve bhadrani pasyantu मा कचिदुखभाग भवे ओं सर्व सतुखी सास्तम चरणारविंदर्पणमस्तु स्वस्ति जय श्रीराम